really fun, but yet can be a little intimidating if you don't know it, don't know what each piece is or does. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your board and the name of the pieces and their function. All right. Well, let's start off with the pawn. That's the pawn, you guys. These are the foot soldiers. Okay. And on the ends, we have the rooks. The rooks. This piece right here, known as the castle, the rook can go straight as many as he wants or left to right as many squares as he wants. As long as he's open and able to do that. He cannot go this way. He cannot uh, go this way. He can only go straight up and down and side to side if the blocks are open. Okay? All right, the knight. The knight is the only piece that can be, uh, that can skip over other pieces and he moves in an L or a seven. So he goes like this, one, two, over, or one, two, over. You can go two up, left or right, okay? He can also do this, one, two, up, okay? One, two, up. Or if he happens to be right here, he can go one, two, up. All right. The bishop. The bishop is the only one that can go in a V. All right, he can only move this way. Okay. As many as he wants, just as long as he's open. As long as they're open. Remember, the only one that can skip is the knight. Okay. He can go this way or this way. As many as he wants, as long as they're open. The queen. The queen is very vital in this game. The queen, you don't want her to, to die so soon in the game, okay? Because she's the only one that can move any, can go anywhere. And as many blocks as you want. Squares, okay? She can, let's say she's right there. She can go bam. Bam, this way, that way, down. She cannot hop. The only one that can skip like that, like I said, is the knight, okay? So you might want to keep her protected. And the pawns. The pawns are the only ones that can move two times in the beginning. So let's say I'm going first. That's my play. They cannot go this way or that way unless there's a kill bam i got you okay that's the only time they can move that way and vice versa let's say he got me okay but in the beginning of the game they're allowed to take two and that's it skip two and then after that they can only move one that's all okay the object of this game is to kill the king now the king, or put him in check, checkmate, okay? The king can go any square, only one square at a time. So if, let's say I, my, my king is right here on the five and the B, okay? Five and the B, and this one's right there. He can kill, okay? One over, okay? And then I'm there. Now, let's say he moves up. My king can move anywhere he wants, only one square at a time, okay? But normally, that only happens at the end of the game if you're really down to the wire. But, uh, yeah, you want to keep him protected back here. want to keep him protected back there, okay? That's pretty much the basics of chess, you guys. Eight diagrams. Uh, 32 pieces now these these are uh, Okay You get extra ones of these because let's say um, Let's say a pawn reaches all the way Let's 
skip these guys. Let's say my pawn reaches up all the way here on this end of the board, okay? Queen me, all right? We take the pawn away, and now I'll have two queens that can attack. That's why there's extra ones, okay? All right. And if you already used up this one, and let's say he got your rook already, the game's already been playing, and one of my pawns reaches all the way to the end. Okay, reaches all the way over here. And there's no more queen. The queen's already in action. Well, I can say rook me, okay? The next best thing over. So on and so forth. That's pretty much the basics of this game, you guys. Um, give it time. Study it. There's strategic plays to this wonderful game and uh yeah this is the way you want to properly set up your board you got the rook you got the uh the knight the bishop the queen the king the bishop the knight and the rook and then all your pawns in the front all right you guys i hope uh hope you found this video useful and if you have any questions or concerns or just want to comment go ahead and comment below all right till then have fun play chess at all times of the day it's a good way to wake up get your mind flowing each move you make is critical all right peace you guys